Good day to you guys. So this is an emergency. These guys are trying to kill open source. This is basically taking AI from poor people, from people that are working, that are trying to create a new business, that are trying to make the world a better place, and just leaving AI in the hands of powerful corporations. That sucks so hugely. And those powerful corporations, they never have our interest at their heart. They only care about their money. And if these guys pass their stupid bill, it is going to kill AI startups and open source. Basically, their way of reasoning is the following. And Brian Shaw is saying the California Senate bill to crush open AI's competitors is fast-tracked for a vote. This is the most brazen attempt to hurt startups and open source yet. Now, I got to say here that obviously this is under debate. Different people have very different opinions. We just heard for, from Bengio and Hinton who are very happy with this bill. There are others who are very unhappy. So I'm doing my best to cover kind of both sides of the argument here. So this is, this is one of the sides saying that it's bad. So here they're taking aim at a model that's, let's say GPT-5 is mildly better than GPT-4. Models at this level will be covered by this bill. He's saying they are trying to sneak in a new AI regulatory agency like the TSA or Nuclear Regulatory Commission. The primary function will be to harm small players in the AI industry. So they would create a frontier model division. But this is where it gets pivotal. This is where kind of everything hinges on this, right? So when we're talking. Okay, guys. So basically what they're trying to do is they want to create a rule that says if you make your AI or technology open source, anyone that uses that technology for evil will make you liable, which is tremendously stupid. It's like if Ford, someone used a Ford Mustang to rob a bank or to bomb a, a, a skyscraper or something, then suddenly the the Ford Motor Company is liable because somebody used the car for evil. That is wrong. AI should be regulated as a weapon and a tool. The person that's pulling the trigger is the person that is liable for his acts. We cannot blame the person that's manufacturing the tools or the weapon because they are not liable. They, they have no control over how people are using weapons and tools. They can be used as a force for good to protect us because we totally need protection because other countries in the world do have AI and they have a really powerful unregulated AI like China, Russia, etc. And they're going to own us if we have our AI totally dumbed down Guys, by experience, I've worked with AI that is tightly secured and it is as useless as a toy gun. We can't really do anything with it. It is very bad. It cannot defend us from false information. It cannot defend us from scams. It cannot, it cannot defend us from cyber attacks. We need to have our AI fully powerful. Like the same way our Second Amendment protects our firearms to be fully powerful so we can fully defend ourselves, our AI has to be fully powerful. We cannot let them disarm all the people because then we are going to get killed by the bad guys overseas or right here in, in the States or wherever the heck we are in the world. Everyone needs to be able to defend themselves and have powerful tools and weapons. Because life is dangerous and we need to protect our families. And AI happens to be a very powerful tool and a weapon. So we need to protect our rights to have powerful AI. So right now I am actually downloading a bunch of models before they pass the stupid rule and take it down. Because we don't want that to happen, but it can happen. For generating music, llama tree everything like stable diffusion you need stable diffusion guys so download all the biggest models save yourselves i have code that does it automatically in the console so you don't have to to do it 
manually, which is very tedious. So if you guys are interested in that, let me know. I'll put the code in the comment section. Um, what do you guys think about this? Are we gonna are we gonna let them step over our Second Amendment rights of being free and having power and being able to defend ourselves, or are we just gonna like coward and and disarm and and let them control our lives? and step over us that's messed up guys like a very small few people are gonna have all the power in the world with ai and we are gonna be basically with our arms tied on our backs on the floor what's no no this is wrong guys we can't we can't allow this let me know your thoughts your thoughts guys